Hi, Mr. Brian. You wanted to see me? Yes, yeah, sure. You and um, I need to talk to you. Well, obviously, you told me to stop by. You told me to stop by your classroom after school. So what's up? Are you having trouble in science? Why do you ask? Just answer the question. Or are you just being lazy? Okay, I'll answer. I am. Are you really struggling with science, or are you just being lazy? <laughs> okay, look, I'm. I am struggling. Well, why didn't you say something? I don't know. I thought maybe I could handle it myself. And can you? Only not. Here's your here's your your last test. A D minus. Listen, Cheyenne, I know you're a smart girl. You can do better than this. I'm gonna um have to call your mom. Please don't call my mom. I'll tell her. Okay, fine. You have 24 hours to tell her. And I'll know if you tell her or not. How? Because I'm going to call your mom tomorrow after school and schedule a parent-teacher conference. Is that necessary? Maybe we'll study that. This isn't fair. I have a hard time understanding the material. Well, you should have said something. Because, look, I'm in high school now. I thought I could handle things on my own. Yeah, and how's that working out for you? Not great. Look, Cheyenne, I know that you're smarter than this. You can do this. I gotta go. Hey, hey, how'd you meet with Mr. Ryan went? Uh, it didn't. You mean he didn't want to see you out for? No, I mean, it didn't go well. Why? What's going on? I failed my last science test. You failed another test? Yeah, and I don't know how I'm going to tell my mom. You don't have to tell her. Yes, I do. Mr. Ryan said I, I had 24 hours to tell mom. And he said that if I didn't, he would call mom. Really? Yeah, so I'm, I'm stuck. I mean, if I tell mom, I'm going to get in trouble. But if I don't tell mom, I'll get in trouble. Well, yeah, but maybe if you're honest about it, your mom won't be too hard on you. Yeah, but you don't understand. I told mom that I would be responsible and get good grades. If she sees, if she finds out about my D minus in science, she's gonna kill me. What do you think I should do? How am I gonna tell her? I love you, but I don't have your answers. Yeah, some best friend you are. Hey, don't get mad at me. You're the one who failed the test. I'm sorry, but failing a test makes a person irritable. I'll see you tomorrow. Hey, it's gonna be okay. I hope. Hmm. Cheyenne, is that you? Oh, hey, Mom, I didn't see you. Don't lie to me. How was school? Um, it was great. Why did it take you so long to answer? I got tongue-tied? Is there something you want to tell me, Cheyenne? What would I be able to tell you? How did you do on your science test? Uh, I didn't fail. I passed. Well, that's good, honey. I'm proud of you. Yeah, um, I'll be in my room doing my homework. Yeah, she's up to something. <laughs> Ugh. Shane, what's wrong? Nothing. So you flopped on your bed like that for no reason? I have to tell you something, and I really need to tell some this to somebody. But you have to promise to keep it between us. Um, okay. What's wrong? I failed my science test. You failed your science test? Well, kind of. I got a D minus. So what did Mom say when you told her you failed a test? I didn't tell her. Why not? Because I don't want Mom to be disappointed in me. You know, Mom's going to find out sooner or later, then you'll be in even more trouble. I know, but I don't know how I'm going to tell Mom. I really don't. Hmm. Is that all you could say is, hmm? Well, I'm sorry, but I'm just a kid. I don't know what I would do in that situation. Well, that's easy for you to say, 
You get straight A's. Yeah, and it never gets old either. You know, you're, you're no help at all. You know, if you want, I could help you with science. What makes you think you could do high school science? You're not even in middle school yet. Come on, you know I skipped a, few, a couple grades, didn't you? Ugh, yes, and it's driving me nuts how you have to keep reminding me. I'm not and reminding you because I'm, be, I'm bragging. I'm just trying to reassure you that I can help you. I'd rather have mom help me. Well, how is she going to help you if she doesn't know you're struggling? <sighs> I hate when you're right. Well, get used to it. I'm getting older. <sighs> Just wait here. I got to talk to mom. Hey. It's going to be okay. Thanks. <sighs> mom? Cheyenne. Sure, yeah. I really need to talk to you. Sit down. Look, I know you're upset with me about me interrupting your soap opera, but I really need to talk to you. Sweet, my stories can wait. No, they can't. I mean, it's not like they're gonna show a repeat. I have the DVR on, but I have a feeling that's not what you came to, here to see me for. What's going on? I lied to you. What do you mean you lied to me? I actually failed my science test. Well, basically, I got a D minus. I know, your teacher just emailed me. He said that he would give me 24 hours to tell you. Oh, so you're admitting that that's true? Well, yeah. I wish you would have done that to begin with. Mom, I'm sorry. I thought that if I hid it from you and then studied, you wouldn't suspect that I was failing science. I was afraid you'd be angry with me. Sweetheart, I'm your mother. You don't have to hide things from me. And I know you're a good student. If you're struggling with science, you should have come to me and told me what was going on. You're right. So go ahead, ground me. I'm not going to ground you. What? No, you're not going to be grounded. Why? Because I'm going to help you with your science. I had a feeling before that you were struggling. I was just waiting for you to come and tell me the truth. But I thought you just said my teacher emailed you. He did. But he also told me that you've been struggling. You weren't just being lazy. Mom, honey, you've always been pretty good in science. Yeah, Mom, but that was middle school science. This is high school biology, and it's hard, really hard. I mean, ever since I started 10th grade, everything's gotten more difficult. But biology is the worst. Well, I'm gonna help you. You mean, are you gonna get me a tutor? Like a cute, handsome, looks like Brad Pitt tutor? No, I'm, you're going to have an old mother tutor who's slowly losing patience with her daughter. I'm gonna help you with your bio biology every night until your grade comes up. You mean that's it? I'm not going to be punished or anything? No, but no lying to me, even little ones. Deal. All right, go get your books and we'll, we'll study your science together. Thanks, Mom. You're the best. I know I am. <laughs> now go get your books. <laughs>